That's the too bad. Let's see what they say. So is that remote control pretty yummy, honey? They're very good. They're yeah. outrageously wonderful. Wow. All this time I've been getting you cow ears and yeah. pig ears, but There's really... Cow no cow ear? Nope. I thought she ate a remote control, so I thought that yeah. she... It's probably remember? good for a day or two. Gotcha. You know. Yep. The harder you push, the better we get. Introducing oh, I forgot. The world's first okay. compression sleeve with a cooling sensation of menthol. The more you move, the more you'll feel the support. Our most advanced compression sleeve here. Oh, the heavyweight weave with seamless four-way stretch for continuous compression and faster recovery. There we go. Muscles and joints. Get the full a little bit better. Yeah. Good call. Yeah. Yeah. Um, one of the dogs that came by today has. Uh, uh, growth on uh, it's a mammary gland, I guess on the on the mammary gland. So, um, but it's a huge, huge growth. Yeah, they're gonna remove it, but uh, they were gonna do it last week, but they had a bunch of emergency surgeries because I guess a lot of dogs are being hit by cars lately because the Christmas season or something. Yep. Yeah, so it's hard for the doggies, but anyway, I said, I asked the lady, I said, well, how long do they usually take to heal up? And she said about a week. Wow. And I was like, wow. Yeah, this that's like a big old mass. It's like a third the weight of her, you know, it's pretty, pretty massive. She's a little dog and... Yeah. So Is that why they gave her up? She's over there? Yeah, they probably gave her up because... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dog planning in an hour? Why don't I just go meet him? Since you've not had breakfast yet. Okay. But that'll be nice for her to be able to move around yes. much better. Yes, of course. Because right now it hurts her or whenever she moves. Yeah. Yeah, it's really, it's like, it's like having a, a, a pot belly pig on your arm, on your, on your, on your chest. It's, uh, it's really, it's really massive. But she's been, she's a good girl. She's really good. Considering, you know. Yeah. I'm just really concerned about introducing another dog here. Sure. Oh, yeah. yeah, I know. Yep. She's plenty of dog for me. I don't want to have this. Is nice. Not, I'm so not glad you're here. Something happens to her. I can't wait to right. show you everything. And for you to meet Henry and the Carters. Also, I thought. Maybe I could swing you by the museum so you can see where I work. I would love nothing more, my little lizard. I am so proud of you. So what have you been doing this week? Oh, I got out for the day. I know, it's crazy, right? And I did me too, and then they had to chase me and discovered that. Oh, mom could be here to see what a pain it is to have to chase her down the street. Me too. Should we go and put her stocking up? It was about a week ago, I think. Howard let her out. Oh. Don't want to chase her down the street. It's a real scary thing. Yeah. But you came back, huh, honey? Yeah, rounded her up. Lots of love. Howard found her first. Yeah. Gave her back just holding her collar, but she's a handful. Yeah. I was left with a leash. Is strong. Okay, she is. You guys go but she cooperates. When you come back, she doesn't pull on her. Good. 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 Good
Good night, girls. Yeah, she doesn't pull. She used to be in that leash. Yeah. I mean, she was trained. Well, I got her. So, I'm sorry. No, so. I'm sorry. I just feel like I've missed so much of your life since you moved, and it took me by surprise. We used to be so close. We still are, aren't we? I had no idea how close you were to Henry's family. And when I heard that you were ready to get married, I panicked. How could I not know that my baby sister is ready to get married? Well, to be fair, I didn't exactly give you a heads up. Why? I was worried what you'd think. You're my favorite person in the world. You practically raised me, and I trust you and value your opinions more than anybody. I'm gonna call them. I'm scared. I thought you were ready to approve if you saw us at first. Talk to them on Monday. See if they'll replace it. And that he treats you well. And that he knows that I'm your favorite person in the world. I don't even know if he's going to propose this year anyway. One second, I have no doubt that he's going to, and then maybe get next, an extreme door that I doesn't like drag. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe he's not ready. Maybe I'm not. Don't overthink it. Come here. And I'm sorry for being distant. Literally, you can't my heart. Wait. There's no need to apologize for living your best life. I'm happy for you. We're just gonna have to work a little harder. I'm staying in touch. That's all. Especially if you're going to be trying to Why? You sent me slip. You sent me a picture of the slippers that you have that have a hole in the bottom. Yeah. But hopefully the slippers that I gave you, they won't. They didn't have any that have heels. There are heels like this. They're all open. Yeah, they're all open from what I saw. But uh, like I said, I I didn't get the exact ones that you wanted. But uh, I think they're a little bit more sturdy. They won't uh, get a hole in the bottom. Yeah. Now, if Nova gets a hold of them, then I don't know. You might get a hole in them. Yeah, cause she's got a, she's got to test, ta- taste, test them. You know, make sure they're okay. Make sure they're okie dokie. She says, "What are you talking about? Everything I do is good." Everything I do is good. It's full of love. Look, I'm not saying it won't be a These are from Macy's, but they were really on sale after Christmas sale one time. Oh. The Charter Club is a brand. Charter Club, okay. Look, take it and enjoy your holiday. Yeah, I was going to look for the brand, but uh, they were kind of, the brand was kind of scratched out, so I, it's hard for me to tell. I, I could see it was a club, but I didn't know what. Christmas trifle and meat pies. Oh, I almost forgot. 
A silver coin? Mm-hmm. It's said that whoever finds the silver coin in that piece of Christmas pudding will have good luck and wealth for the forthcoming year. I like that tradition. Apparently it dates back to the 13th century. Mm-hmm. How's your father adjusting to the time difference? He's still sleeping. Oh, well, good. Do you remember Grandpa's wishing tree? One of my wishes was that I would be married by the time I was 35. Since it is time to let that go, Mona Sinclair. Let's go have a holiday romance. Mona! Hey! How about two? Just a minute. You don't care. How much you know that Dad is the love of your life? How about when you feel? Don't give us your second chance. Wow. Christmas with a kiss. All new tonight at 8 on Hollywood. At Domino's, we know life doesn't always go as planned, which is why we're giving you a free pizza. So, have you talked to Judy Bagro? Um, a couple of weeks ago, Margaret came over. She lives up in, Margaret was somebody that we went to, I don't remember I talked about her. She went to uh, Arizona Western College, which we did. Uh-huh. And then her and Russ, that was her boyfriend, they went back to Ohio. And they got married back there. I think she's in school, but she never, she never did anything with it. She worked with some guy. And they had a whole bunch of money. Oh, okay. Um, but uh, they want me to go out and eat dinner tonight, which I have some money. I'm not worried about that. I feel so crappy at night. Right. So I could have got what she Stupid. Yeah. Yeah, I was wondering if you talked to Judy Bradgroom or not. Usually she sends me a birthday card. Oh, okay. I sent her one on her birthday. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I see. What if we paid the contestants their winnings in gold instead of cash or prizes? Back in nineteen seventy six we had a wonderful contestant named Lee whose three day winnings were valued at twelve thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars. And you know what? That was a pretty big haul back in nineteen seventy six. So I wonder. What would have happened if Lee had put $12,850 in cash and then put $12,850 in gold in a safe? Just sitting there side by side from 1976 until now. We all know that $12,850 in cash would still be sitting there, but it would be worth a whole lot less than it was in 1976. But that $12,850 in gold safely stored away, it's worth $135,000 as of the taping of this commercial. Now, that's more than 10 times the original amount. And since the taping of this commercial, the price of gold has increased substantially to more than 15 times the original amount. And that's why I've been putting my money in precious metals for years, and I don't see any reason to stop now. If you bought gold in the past or would like to learn more about why physical gold should be an important part of your portfolio, call and receive the complete guide to buying gold, which will provide you important, never seen before facts and information you should know about making gold, silver, and platinum purchases. You can also receive a copy of our exclusive new report for 2023. Inside, you'll find the top Not 10 yesterday reasons I why you need to start buying gold today. With two decades Not of too long, a couple of days ago, we were working in the shed trying to clean that out. out. I had a wash and dryer in there. I sold. US money reserve is one of the yep. most and I think I kind of took out my cat. Hi, I'm Jason. I've lost two oh. He went things in there. Oh, I see. So, I'm not being able to climb upstairs without taking a break. 
just not committed to go like the rat. Ooh, a snail. What? You know, when I was teaching the first time, I was you a bread. Yeah. Help me out. What's that? Hopefully, they'll help me out and do something about the guy that. You didn't get cash back on top of the sale. You can still save yourself a bunch of money. I just might really talk to you in the air. Uh huh. I see. Delicious too. Just ask my old friend Kevin. Doesn't like to join the call. Yeah, we'll talk some on a Monday. Who's winning? We are, my friend. We are. I contracted out to somebody locally. Oh. And I don't know really who the guy was. Her sister. Her sister. This guy that was with him. Oh, Dad, you didn't save any for the inventory. Well, you still didn't see a lose. 